The getting started part of a career choice or a career change can often be the hardest part. So in this video, I'm giving you three strategies that will get you moving in the right direction. Helen Horiza here, ready to give you information and strategies that you won't be able to find anywhere else. On this channel, I have the Elevate Your Career Cycle and the Elevations Career Assessment, all kinds of tools to help you get going in the right direction. If you're new here, subscribe. Now let's jump into the video. Over the years, working with clients, helping them make career choices and career changes, the beginning is always the hardest part. They're like, how do I get started, Helen? And so I've come up with three things that you really need to focus on to ensure that you're going to be making good decisions and that the quality of your outcome is going to be as high as possible. I'm going to actually use myself as an example to tell you about these three strategies. The first one is take stock of your assets. And when I was in my 20s and I was making a big career change, I really don't even know what inspired me, but I, I figured this out and I took the time to look at what I had going for me, what was sort of in my court. And the first thing that I had going for me <laughs> was that I was single and that I didn't have to ask anybody else. If I made this big change, I wasn't going to put anybody else into any kind of trouble. And I could eat macaroni and cheese. I didn't need to make much money. And I thought about that. That, that made me feel like, okay, well, that's a good thing. I had a good little car and I had family and friends who loved me and, and taking stock of my assets that gave me that lift to get going in the right direction. The second thing that I did was I had enough patience. I said, okay, you don't want to jump too quickly. You wanna make sure that you've considered every possibility, that you're not just being impulsive, you're not doing the first thing that comes along. If you're gonna get started, you wanna make sure that you're not jumping too quickly. And the last thing that I had as a strategy was I understood that I was at a crossroad. I understood that I was at a decision point. And I understood that that was gonna bring some anxiety with it and that that's natural. And so allowing myself to feel that anxiety um, allowed me to keep moving forward, getting going without waiting for me to feel just great about everything because that wasn't gonna happen real soon. So my action step actually for you, of course, are these three things. Would you please take stock of your assets? Would you have some patience and give yourself a little space? Realize you're in a crossroad. I'll see you soon.